Hey guys, welcome back to another video, and this time I'm here in the newly renovated um, gas station and burger house, and I'm here with uh, the Alfa Romeo, uh, wait, let me pronounce this, Giulia Quadrifoglio. Yes, I think I got that right. So, um, yeah, I actually repainted this car, so you cannot, this is not a stock color, so it's 155 red with 5% shine, that's it. So, yeah, I think this car looks amazing. It has four exhaust pipes. I think the back looks really nice with that carbon spoiler. Um, the front looks great too for me, not as much as the back, but uh, yeah, I really like the look of this car. And this car, honestly, it's, I, I drive this so much. It's one of my favorite cars. It's just so nice to drive. Okay, so it's the ordinary startup. I always put this thing in manual. Listen to this rev though, because now it sounds really good. Yeah, so that sounds amazing now. It sounds like, I think, like the real car. Yeah, so this thing wants to slide a bit. It's rear wheel drive. This thing's just so nice. It handles so nicely. Uh, oh! Seize! Wait. So this thing actually, you know, I think they should fix, fix the top speed on this car because in real life, I think this thing goes faster than... I think this thing does like 190 some miles an hour. In this game, it only does 165. I mean, it's fast enough for the game, but to make it real, it should go like 190. So yeah, things I don't like about this car, uh, well, there's only one thing. Well, well, actually, there's two things. One kind of slightly bothers me, the other one I don't really like. So the part that something bothers me is the top speed, but um, what kind of annoys me is the 8-speed is the transmission. With an 8-speed transmission, you cannot do burnouts or just donuts in first gear, look. Because the engine's just, it's just not going fast enough, you have to go into second. And to be able to drift, you need to go into third. But when you do, it does drift pretty well. That that okay, that's my fault. Okay, it's not the car's fault. Okay, here we go. Okay, third. Okay, I can do better. Okay, I'm gonna turn off here. Here we go. Ah, uh, I can do better than that. Okay, let's see a nice drift. Yeah! So there's only one trim with this car. It's the... Um, I think in this game it's called the quad luck. So, and it only comes with one um, wheel trim as well. So... Yeah, but... That doesn't really matter because the standard trim, like in real life, the standard trim is like a 2 liter. I just love the way this car drives though, look at this. You can do those little slides without breaking the rules. Okay, now I am. If I were in an RP server, I'd be breaking the rules, but I'm not. Oh look, okay, let's let's try drift without breaking the rules. So here's third gear. FRP speeds, let's say 70. That's perfectly legitimate. This thing's really fast though. Yeah, 165, but it's really quick to accelerate. Okay, braking from 165. That's really good. Okay, now let's do braking from 100.
Okay, set our cruise control. And break. Yeah, no problems there. By the way, look at the diffuser. That's really big. I'm not gonna do the ice test this time because I've tried it and it's really bad. It's just gonna spin out and forth, so there's no point, but. But this thing's just so nice. <coughs> okay, I, I, I suppose I should show the flashers, so. Here we go, those are the blinkers. Horn, that's pretty much it. I'm gonna do a zero to sixty. Whoops, messed that up. Okay, that's really fast. Whoa. <coughs> so yeah, this thing handles well, it breaks well, it sounds great, it's pretty fast. And it's like only, I think it costs like $51,000, so it's pretty cheap too. And the braking is amazing. Like before I actually, I, I like I bought this car and I could not drive it because it sounded so bad. But now it sounds so good. Yes, yeah, so you know what? I think I'm going to end this video here. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.